story, if you will, about work and excuses. Two things Irish are very good at. Dear sir, I write this note to you to tell you of my plight. For at the time of writing, I am not a pretty sight. My body is all black and blue, my face a deathly gray. And I write this note to say why Pat is not at work today. Whilst working on the 14th floor, some bricks I had to clear. And to throw them down from such a height was not a good idea. The foreman wasn't very pleased, he'd be an awkward sod. Well, he said I'd have to call them down the ladders in my hut. So I'm skipping them back as a mirror. Now, clearing all these bricks by hand, it was so very slow. So I hoisted up a barrel and secured the rope below. But in my haste to do the job, I was too blind to see that a barrel full of building bricks was heavier than me. So when I untied the rope, the barrel fell like lead. And clinging tightly to the rope, I started up instead. I shot up like a rocket till to my dismay I found that halfway up, I met the bloody barrel coming down. Well, the barrel broke my shoulder as to the ground it sped. And as I reached the top, I banged the pulley with my head. I clung on tightly, numb with shock from this almighty blow. And the barrel spilled out half the bricks, the 14 floors below. Now, when these bricks had fallen from the barrel to the floor, I then outweighed the barrel and so started down once more. Still clinging tightly to the rope, my body wrapped with pain. When halfway down, I met the bloody barrel once again. Well, the force of this collision halfway up the office block caused multiple abrasions and a nasty state of shock. Still clinging tightly to the rope, I fell towards the ground. And I landed on the broken bricks, the barrel scattered round. Now as I lay there bleeding on the ground, I thought I'd passed the worst. But the barrel hit the pulley wheel, and then the bottom burst. A shower of bricks rained down on me. I hadn't got a hope. As I lay there bleeding on the ground, I let go of the fucking rope. Now, with the barrel being heavier, it started down once more And landed right across me as I lay upon the floor It broke three ribs in my right arm and I can only say That I hope you'll understand why Patty's not at work today